Hello, this is Orville the Curtain Clammy with another review. Today's review is going to be Master of the Universe Revolution. And um, I will be doing another video. Sorry, I haven't been really posting them lately. I'm just, I really don't care about YouTube too much. And there hasn't been really anime related stuff. This came out not too long ago. I want to review it. I'm going to, I'm reviewing, re watching. I would say uh, Dragon Ball Super and doing a video on that. It's going to take a while because it's pretty long. I'm about 40 episodes in, so. And it has about like 140 episodes. So that's going to be a while before I get that out. It's uh, going to be if Dragon Ball Super still sucks. But well, until this review. Now, this was interesting. To say the least, because they did like a complete 180 on everything that we're doing with the series so far. Like, Tila is now into He-Man. The Master of Arms chick, can't remember her name, for the life of me, is not in a relationship with her anymore. It, it feels really weird, and um, the women are now very feminine looking. Not like um, muscle, like built, like jacked anymore. And they're more feminine now, which is a little bit weird. <laughs> they completely changed the characters from what they were building into this. And uh, the story is pretty bad. I'm going to spoil a lot of things because I don't think you should watch this. Even though I think it was a little bit better, but like... Overall, it's just like felt really weird that they finally gave the audience what they wanted, but it felt really too late and poorly done. Extremely poorly done. Evelyn turns good, of course. He man's father dies, even though he could be healed by Tila, or at least the very least, it seems like he could cure him from whatever ailment he's from. Um, we're not too sure why he's dying, but it seems like he could be cured. And he's like, no, I don't want to be cured. We all die. Well, yeah, that's true, but if you can be cured, why die now? Uh, plot. A lot of stuff happens because of plot. Uh, because Skeletor gets memories of Keldor, which actually was a real thing, I guess. His uh, brother. The he man's... Uh, Father's brother, Keldor, because his skull was crushed. Yeah, that's a lot of shit that makes no damn sense happens. Uh, Tila gets some snake powers. Um, I think Harkon, that's, that's his name, I can't remember his name. Uh, he's kind of useless throughout there. So is kind of Skeletor, I guess that's his stick though. And uh, not a whole lot. Real progression. I, I do like some of the character development we had with the Rin here, but it's completely opposite of what they were doing with the other two series. That it's like completely different fucking show. It feels like I just don't. Know, I really was lost. I was like, did I skip a season somewhere? Like because it makes almost no sense of why they just completely turned this around. Is please an audience that they haven't been pleasing so far up to now so it feels extremely confusing so if I would give this a score it'd probably be like a 4 a little bit below average it, it has some pretty good fight scenes, and they did make it about, more about He-Man. They did make a really weird ending out of it that he gave up the monarchy and made the people in charge, which was really weird. Do you think, you know, a lot of these shows have this anti-capitalism, anti-establishment kind of message to them? And that, 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 that actually kind of really surprised me that they, they did that at the end. It's like so confusing. I was like, why not just keep going with your nonsense and just finish it? You might as well at this point. It probably would have made more sense to the end. At least that would have that. But other than that, 
I probably wouldn't give it a watch unless you really want to see the ending to the series. It's nonsensical, and a lot of stuff that happens is just plot-driven, which is very disappointing. That's pretty much all I have to say about it. Thank you for listening. Right, comment, subscribe.